This is how to mount absolute black oval subcompact chain rings. We're beginning with a Shimano Ultegra 8000 crank and then a Dura Ace 9100. To fit 3046 subcompact oval rings, we use a pair of M7 alloy bolts and two M5 titanium bolts. A Torx T30 for the M7s and a T25 for the M5s. First, take the crank arm and the outer chainring and orientate the curved tab on the chainring with the corresponding curved tab on the crank arm. It's bottom right when viewed head on. Next, take the inner chainring and observe the small orientation tooth which sits behind the crank arm. The inner chainring uses threaded holes so there are no spacers or nuts. Ensure the raised holes face the crank arm. Again, check the location of the orientation tab before the bolts are applied. Now turn the crank over and fit the two M7 bolts with the Torx T30 key. These bolts can be tightened to 5 Newton meters. Then fit the two smaller M5 bolts. These smaller bolts can be tightened to 4 Newton meters. And there you have your new absolute black subcompact road oval chain rings fitted to your Shimano Ultegra 8000 crank. The process is identical for the Shimano Dura Ace 9100. Again, take the outer chainring and look for the curved tab. There is only one, so you won't miss it. It's designed to fit the corresponding curved tab on the crank arm to ensure that you orientate the chainring correctly. Remember, it's at the bottom right as you look at the cranks from the outside. Turn the crank and the chainring over and as with the Ultegra cranks, ensure that the orientation tab on the inner chainring is positioned behind the crank arm and that the raised threaded bolts are facing the crank. Double check the orientation. Turn the crank over. Do the bolts up. And you're ready to ride. Try an oval and never look back. Absolute black.